All right, welcome to Uzulu Garage today. Today we're going to do a quick detail on this Ford Edge. This is basically no paint correction. We're just going to wash it, clean the interior, and put a spray wax on here. We're going to use some turtle wax for the black ceramic spray on there. And then we're going to be cleaning the interior with some turtle wax products. And we'll be using some other products for the leather, some chemical guys, stuff like that. I'm going to use a um, mix of products. We're going to use chemical guys. So it's just wash and gloss. It's really good cleaner. We're just giving it a nice, you know, we're just making it look clean. That's it. For this package of our detail right here. Make it look good. Just clean it up for the customer right here. We're not going to be doing no paint correction. Just clean it up. And then maybe down the line, they will come back and uh, get a paint correction up and up better. It's not too bad. It's not too bad. Okay, we're going to get ready to vacuum it up. Okay, we're going to use Simple Green to clean up the mats right here, rubber mats, get it cleaned up. Me personally, I like spraying the water first real quick. We got C4 Lou right here, helping with the detail. Our goal is to try to get some more customers and do like jobs like this, just a nice cleaning, no paint correction, in and out. And we got this right here. For interior, we're going to use Turtle Wax Ice interior cleaner now at the end of the video i'm going to talk about the price that i charge for some kind of some a cleaning like this so you guys will know in my area so that'd be at the end of the video and plus too i'm gonna have some end links for other videos and then if you wanna i have a link right now popping up if you want to check out us using this on another car right here to the wax pretty good product you can use this on leather too to clean it we're going to clean the leather with chemical guys leather cleaner and conditioner but i might go over the leather with this also and then use those two other products it's pretty hit i want to see what this how well this does on cleaning leather also all right i'm going to clean the windows later i like spraying it on the surface and we'll see let's see a little section we're gonna soak it up a little bit today clean it This has a nice smell too for odor. Look at that. Clean it up. Check it out. Before and after. Looking good.
okay. So I've changed my mind instead of using the citrus wash and gloss from Kimmel guys. We'll try to stick with some the turtle wax products. So we're gonna wash it with the super foaming car wash. Some good uh, wash. We'll use that, and then we're gonna put a turtle wax. I decided to go for this detail. Their seal and shine, the most popular seal and shine from Turtle Wax. We all know this stuff works and it lasts a long time. Very chemical resistance from all those tests. Check it out. Just pour a lot in there. So it's only a couple bucks. Okay, around the match, we're going to apply some from Subbot Shadow. It's a trim dressing, great for rubber. And uh, if your plastic trim, you can also use it and on your interior. Plastic and stuff like that. Now, it doesn't last long in our environment for outside use, for like exterior use right here. If you don't get a lot of rain in your environment, it will last a lot longer. But it's great, I think, for uh, mats and for interior. Gives it a little bit of a shine. We'll show the end results when we're all done with the mat. Even though we're working on a sun, it's not really hot out. What is it today? You know? We're about gonna be between 60 and 70. Paint's not hot, so yeah, it's not even hot at all. It just tells it's not we're good to go. It looks like it's hot, but it's not. Perfect detail weather. No phone can today. Washing the roof first. Get it nice and clean. These wheels are pretty much it. We're just gonna get them cleaned up. Make it clean, not perfect. Did the tires get that? There we go. Make it look decent. Hey, we're gonna do something. Come on, guys, right here. Check it out. We'll clean it up. Even though we did the turtle wax on here, it came out pretty good. But we're gonna do this real quick with the cleaner, spray it down, and wipe it off, and then we'll go with the leather conditioner right here. We'll get it looking good. Wipe her in. That simple. You can use a, a brush too since we cleaned it, cleaned it pretty good. We don't need to use the, the interior brush. You can get for leather and vinyl. I'll have some links also for all these products that we are using today and more. 
and I'll link um, the interior brush also on there if you want to if you do purchase something from Amazon it does help the channel a little bit and then we can buy products and test them out and show you guys yeah I do like come with guys leather cleaner and conditioner great product and plus Adams also and then Turtle Wax also has a product that works pretty good for leather cleaner. It works pretty good on vinyl. Leather Next up is leather conditioner. It's got vitamin E cream in it from Chemical Guys. It works pretty good. I really like this product. Also a good product is Adams has a good one. And Turtle Wax has a, a leather cleaner also. That's great too for vinyl also. And basically, you know, shake it up. Put it on your cloth. Or if you like, you can put it on your seats. A lot of times I like to put some little bit on the seats and help speed up. Speed it up. I'll check this out real quick. And then I'll have some links for a lot of this stuff. You guys can check it out if you want. That will help the channel. If I already said it, I can't remember if I already said it in the video or what. So I have to bring it up again. Gives it a nice clean look. Put some conditioner back in these seats. Yeah, check it out. Looks good. See how that's still dry? And right there. Those seats are done. Looks pretty good. Still got to do the front. And then we'll be doing the, the seal and shine. You want to just wipe it in there and work it in. Get it nice and clean. And then we'll go at the end of the video. Well, next up, we're going to put the seal inside. And at the end of the video, we'll talk about the products and the price for a detail like this by us in our area. Okay, next up, seal and shine by ice. Basically, just spray it on and wipe it in if you get uh, some streaking. Use a damp cloth and uh, I'll take it off for you. And uh, we burn out in the sun, which is gonna work fast. I'm gonna do right here real quick, just to show you. I'm not gonna show the whole the whole process. Shake it up real good. I might have used too much. Sometimes it's a habit of mine using too much of the product. Just wipe it in, guys. It's that simple. If you get a little shrinking, just use a damp microfiber towel to even it out. A lot of times in my own vehicle, man, the streaking doesn't really bother me. But we'll go over the whole vehicle and we'll look at it. All right, guys, so we finished up the detail on this car. So here's the interior. Man, it looks good. So we used a couple different products on the interior. We used a turtle wax uh, uh, cleaner for actually the dash and kind of just gave a once over for all the. Uh, trim pieces and everything use chemical guys uh, leather cleaner and conditioner for all the leather seats and you know the armrest and stuff like that all right so there's the front here is the back once again the same thing we did in the back that we did in the front we did use some uh, suds box uh, black trim cleaner and brought back the mats so they actually look they're a little glossy but not too bright so it looks really good there see we can brought we brought back a pretty good shine to the paint and here is the back did the same thing Let us know what you guys actually think about uh, the results of this. I think it came out really good. Let us know how you guys feel about that. So we used Ice Seal and Shine by Turtle Wax for all the paint. We did not uh, clay bar or you know compound or polish any of this. This is actually just a wash. 
and then the ceiling shine so gotta say the results are really good for the you know a little bit of work you have to put into it it's compared to uh you know actually having to polish it you still get a pretty good shine obviously there's still going to be the swirl marks in the paint and stuff but overall for a quick little uh product works great it works great too if you actually polish too so cleaned it all up cleaned the rims pretty good too All right guys, so for the floor mats in this car, we use this right here, Sudbox Shadow Dressing and Conditioner. And I have to say, this stuff looks excellent on floor mats. I have to, it, it, it comes out great. It gives it that nice black shine, but it also doesn't make it, you know, too shiny where it's just unreasonable. Is it slippery? It is also not slippery either. It's, it, it looks and feels like it normally would, but it just gives it a very nice shine almost like a brand new shine so definitely recommend using this stuff on floor mats okay guys we're all done detailing this car real quick so in today's video Pretty much we use the turtle wax car wash right here all right and then when you put the interior we use their turtle wax ice to your cleaner and protection and then on the floor mats we use salt box right here shadow came out nice and then for the leather we use their chemical guys leather cleaner and conditioner okay now i used a brake buster by pns right here in the wheels tires and then at the last we use the ice ceiling shine and i'll have links below right here now a detail like this we just basically just wanted he just wanted it cleaned up that's all do the interior and clean it up we kind of threw in a couple extras on there no charge now a detail like this for us in our in our area would be between 60 and 80 dollars this detail from the, the interior took a little longer would have been i would have charged 80 dollars for this uh detail right here so I think that's uh what do you guys charge for if you guys charge what do you guys charge in your area for something exactly what we just did i mean in our area you can't charge a lot um you just you'll never get any customers in our area we would have to move more towards north to get more of a uh, uh, charge more for stuff but that's that's how much we charge for this and it's something too to just to make some extra money and we can uh buy some other products with it and put a little bit back in our channel and uh but yeah definitely uh, let us know what you guys charge and and do you think this is a cheap price or overpriced let us know and uh yeah and then don't forget at the end leaks we'll have some end leaks on using turtle wax products and maybe a car show video you could check it out let's do first time here we do we make videos on auto shows in detroit area videos like this auto detail we test out products and stuff like that so pretty much yeah you guys comment and something you like and join it and i appreciate you guys watching this one and i hope to see you at other videos you guys have a great day later now get out there and clean your cars